What's going on stackers? So in this video I'm going to be sharing with you how to find profitable low and no content book niches using Creative Fabrica. So welcome back to Stacking Profit. My name's Paddy and over here we give you the tools and resources to learn, grow and master passive income streams so that you can live a life of freedom. Now, like I said in this video, I'm going to show you how to find profitable low and no content book niches just by using Creative Fabrica. Now, I don't know about you, but I absolutely love Creative Fabrica. I get all my graphics from here, all my fonts, and I also get some, depending on the niche, interiors. Now, just by using the interiors alone here on Creative Fabrica, you can come up with some really great low content book ideas, which are actually profitable. Now, to do this, we are going to use Creative Fabrica. You don't need an account. You can simply come over here and browse around. And then we're also going to use one of self-publishing titans chrome extensions now these are completely free to use i suggest going and checking them out i'll leave a link in the description down below so you can go through and check them out but the tool that you are going to want to use is this one now i do recommend both they are pretty good but this is my favorite and you're going to see why in a minute so before you watch this video go ahead go over and download the extension then once you have that installed, I'll just close this tab. Once you have that installed, you're going to see the extension up here in the right hand corner. If you click on this, you do have the option to turn it on and off. So I'm going to choose mine to be on. And now we can start looking for some niches. So first of all, you want to come to the KDP section. So we go here, we go up to here to graphics, onto KDP interiors and it brings you to this page. I'll try and link a I'll try and leave a link to this page as well down in the description so it's a little bit easier. Now one thing I do want to note if you do not have a Creative Fabrica account, watch out for the next few weeks or a Creative Fabrica subscription. Watch out over the next few weeks because they will be having a huge sale because it's going to be Black Friday. So if you've been on the fence, been trying to wait for Creative Fabrica to have a sale, then watch very closely because it's going to be happening over the next few weeks. Anyway, let's start looking. What you want to do is come to this page and then just start browsing around. So we're trying to find niches. And then once we've found that niche, we go over to Amazon and then see if there's actual demand for that niche and to see if people are actually searching it. And you can see if it's high demand, low competition using that Chrome extension, which I just showed you. So let's start looking around. Once you start looking around, you're going to come up with so many ideas. Look at all these. So we've got a camping journal, Christmas KDP mega bundle, maybe something you want to look into. We have planners as well. And we can just keep looking around. We can go to page two, page three, page four, browsing through the niches, seeing what there are, and then go over to Amazon, which we'll do in a second, just to see if there's demand. But look, there's so many different types of niches. Christmas coloring pages, more planners, fitness planner. I'm guessing this one would do extremely well come the new year when everyone has their new year's resolutions. Now, one thing I like to do as well is come here and sort by latest. So now we're going to do that. Give that a second to load up and then just keep going through the niches. So we got Christmas activity book, a African coloring book, lots of puzzle stuff as well. And then we got a goal planner, caregiving logbook. So I wonder if that's an actual thing. We can take a look at that in a second. But what I found as well, just by browsing around, was this. So my laptop's playing up a little bit, so just give that a second. 
There we go. So I found this seller a while back. I actually made a video on how to find logbook niches. If you want to watch that video, I'll link that right there in the right hand corner. But I remember this seller, so I thought, oh, I'll just have a look on here and then have a look on Amazon. So I saw this one, Medication Logbook. This took my eye, so I went over to Amazon. This is the Chrome extension, which we spoke about earlier on in the video by self-publishing Titans. This is an awesome extension, and it can help you find high-demand, low-competition niches. It gives you a niche score, which is just here, and anything above 63% is a really great niche. Now me personally, when I use this Chrome extension, I go for niches 40% and above. Main reason being, I don't mind being in niches where the BSRs are around half a million, because once you have 10, 20 of those books, all with a BSR of just under half a million, you can make some really good money. So just keep that in mind as well. But this niche, this was a medication logbook. I found that over here on Creative Fabrica, just here. Now I'm seeing if there's demand. The niche score is 76%, which is really good. And we can see there's only 668 results for this book. Now this would be extremely easy to create because I've done the research. So I found a niche which was here, medication logbook. I can use this interior and then because I've done the research here, medication logbook, yep, looks like a great niche. Then all I would now have to do is create a cover for this interior. Now one thing I would do as well, this welcome page just here, I would delete that and add a new one, just making my book a little bit more unique to everyone else's. But that's how easy it is to find niches just by using Creative Fabrica. Now if we go back to this one, we found this one, this is a caregiving logbook. So now let's go over to here and take a little look. So care giving logbook. So we can see that Amazon is auto-populating it. Now, when Amazon auto-populates it, that means that other people are actually searching for that, and that's why they auto-populate it. So now we can click on there and see how good this niche is as well. Now, by looking at the covers, they don't look like anything special. So it would be really easy to create an eye-catching cover within this niche, because look, they all look very similar. Uh, it's probably because they're actually all the seller, all the same seller. But again, this would actually be, looks like, quite a good niche. There's 672 results. And now let's just give the niche score a few minutes to load up. And bam, there we go. So this extension, it's saying 55%. So for me, that meets my criteria of over 40%. If we take a look at the BSRs, we can see they're not amazing. Some of them are not showing. So maybe they haven't sold yet, or maybe it's just the extension playing up. But we can see they're not amazing BSRs, but with these types of BSRs, this is under half a million, that's under 100,000, that's under a million. So this is more of a micro niche. So a micro niche meaning there's not very many people searching for that, but you can still make a few sales each and every month. Now, caregiving logbook, because it's easy for me to create the book, I have the interior. All I would have to do is create a cover I would probably still go and create this book. There's 672 results, and there's a chance of me still making sales, but that's what I would do. So that's two that we've already found. If we go back over to Creative Fabrica, I would just keep going through all of these interiors, seeing what the niche actually is, and then go over to Amazon, to see if there's demand using the Chrome extension, see if it's high demand, low competition, and see if it's just a book that I want to publish. So look at this one, a KDP cat health tracker log. So I'm guessing that's not really going to be a niche. I could be wrong. So let's take a look. Cat health logbook. Okay, so there actually is Cat Health Logbook is being auto-populated, so we know Amazon, or we know that there's people searching for that, but look at this, there's 7,000 results 
for a cat health logbook. Crazy, I would never have thought of that. But if we take a look at some of the results or some of the BSRs, they're not showing again. I think there's a problem with the Chrome extension or Amazon's done an update. Now, this looks like a niche that I probably wouldn't go and create a book in. So let's find a different one. And just keep looking around because there's so many. Now, if we go back up to the top, we can actually see there's 4,121 results for KDP interiors. So by looking through all of these results, you're going to find those high demand, low competition niches, and it's going to be really easy for you to create a book because we already have the interior because we're doing the research from Creative Fabrica, and then all you would have to do is go and create a cover. So that's just how easy it is to find profitable low and no content book niches using Creative Fabrica. Now, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Also, go hit subscribe and hit that little bell icon so you can be notified for any further videos. That being said, I've been Paddy, this has been Stacking Profit, and I'll see you again soon.